make sure that when you're going into the court, whether you're a defendant or a claimant, that you go with your lawyer. Your lawyer is the one that will speak for you in the court of law. Viewers and subscribers, welcome to the Arlene Souls YouTube channel. If you are new here, go right ahead and subscribe to this channel. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you for clicking on this video. Thank you for turning on your post notification. Viewers and subscribers, it's Arlene Souls TV here on YouTube. Guys, I appreciate you all. Yeah, legally, yes. I want regarding a court case yes I want you to feel confident yes in knowing the secrets of how to win a case that may be made against you yes sometimes you know we have unscrupulous persons in our lives that will make claims against us yes but I want to remind you, viewers and subscribers, that the most important thing to do whenever you have a court case is to be very bold, yes, and be very truthful because that is what is going to take your case right through its entirety. Yes, viewers and subscribers, I'm here to settle all the myth that you may have. Yes, some people may have myth. You know, some people may use their words in the street to solve a court case, yes. And some people may say, oh, me can win, man, based on me can go in there go tell lie. Yes, but I'm telling you, viewers and subscribers, lies don't work in court. Because I'm warning you, the lies will caught up with you. And I have seen cases where lies caught up with people I know very well. And I want to say to you viewers and subscribers, just be truthful in your doings. Just be truthful in your everyday life. And I'm telling you, honesty and trustworthiness is the best of policy. Viewers and subscribers, it's the Arlene Souls YouTube channel here to highlight you on day-to-day -day challenges or day-to-day activities that we might have to face in our lives yes it's reality and sometimes reality hits you are aware of yes viewers and subscribers so and honest this will take you right through your court case or right through a family member of your court case let's get right in there yes that may fail face legal battles in their life and they are not sure why it came out the way it came out or you know they have a little if and but about how the case went whether they win or they lose but today i'm specifically talking about being a winner in a court case yes oh it is that you can win a court case this these are some of my personal secrets the, the bailiff bring the court document to you in a seal envelope or sometimes it's open meaning it's in pages and it's just come folded to you so you have a right as the the claim the defendant to open the document yes viewers and subscribe sharing my experience with you and I also want you to go ahead and comment in the comment section and share your views or if you have had the experience yes I would also like some feedback from you my viewing audience so once you have found your lawyer you can go ahead and um, hand over all the the documents to your lawyer your lawyer will take upon himself or herself and ask you a few questions regarding the matter that is before him or her and you will have to be able to explain yourself in its entirety do not hide nothing from your lawyer your lawyer will be there to represent you through the court process yes viewers and subscribers and if it's regarding your property or you are to ensure that you have the correct 
lawyer to deal with whatever matter there is. If it's a criminal case, you must have a criminal lawyer. Some lawyers will tell you, oh, I can represent you in many areas. Yes, I know of persons who are professionally trained, but I like to be specific. So if I know that I'm, I have a court matter, I'm going to, and I know it's had, it has to do with property, I can only speak right now for property or for spousal because I have gone through those. I, I am not 100% sure, viewers and subscribers, about the criminal aspect. But the basic that I know regarding criminal um, lawyer is that you must have some kind of practice in, the, in that field. Meaning that if it's, you know, simple larceny, or you know it's a higher um kind of court matter where criminal activity is concerned you know you need a, a well professional lawyer i wouldn't even think about any legal aid legal aid are good but i wouldn't go that route on the property aspect of the law so then viewers and subscribers this video might have to be done in parts so I'm going to be speaking today regarding the property aspect of it yes so if it's a case where a claimant take you to court as a defendant what you are supposed to do you are supposed to find your lawyer of course as I have, as I have said before and take that document to the lawyer the lawyer is going to be asking you the relevant questions regarding the matter Right in this case, it's your property, so you of course must have your tax receipts. Yes, all your tax receipts. Make sure you save those viewers and subscribers. No matter um, if you pay ten years ago or whenever, you must have all your tax receipts filed away in your home. Yes, in a well kept, cool and dry place. Make sure all your receipts regarding your property is filed away so that in case of any emergency such as a lawsuit against you you are able to retrieve your tax receipts you also need your land title yes viewers and subscribers you would be surprised to know that these things are of utmost importance in the court of law are very important in a property matter if you also have a business together right you and your spouse have a business or you and your family member because sometimes family member turn against each other and you know things do happen i'm just saying so viewers and subscribers make sure that all these relevant documents you have them stored away that just you are brought up in the court by your relative or your spouse you have everything regarding the property in your possession okay I must also warn you that you must ensure that you pay all your property taxes. Yes, pay up all your property taxes. Ensure that your water bills are paid. If you have tenants on the premises, also make sure that the tenants are paying the water bills. So, because most times in a court matter regarding property, these things come up. Also, viewers and subscribers, I want you to never forget the truth in this case. Yes. And I also want you to be smart as well, viewers and subscribers. Sometimes what you're right and know, you don't allow your left hand to know because most times it saves you in the court of law. You, you don't be stupid enough to put the, your spouse name on everything. Have something that either way from your spouse that don't have your spouse name on it. Because if it have your spouse name on it regarding the property, you know that if needs be or if the court see it relevant, the court is going to award the complainant against you. Yes, that means the court is going to give the complainant a part of the property whoever is the complainant whether it's your brother your sister your husband your wife 
So make sure that whatever you are doing, you are doing it in a way to protect yourself. Yes, viewers, and make sure that your lawyer have a copy of all the documents so that when he or she goes into the court of law to represent you, they have all the required documents that I have listed, they have them so that when the judge asks for them or when the other person's lawyer mention anything regarding any assets that you may own in the property, that the lawyer has all these documents because viewers and subscribers, that is the reason why I keep saying the truth is very important when it come on to a court case regarding property because viewers and subscribers the the complainant can go in the court of law and tell a lie on you and you would be surprised you would be in the court wondering my god why is my brother saying this or my god why is my sister saying this or my god why is my husband saying this or my god why is my wife saying this and what you don't have anything to prove against what they are saying because sometimes their persons are so wicked enough that they go into the court of law and tell a lie on you regarding that property they may say oh well it's me well i am the one who's been paying the taxes for the past five years your honor and your honor is gonna say okay well present the receipt or your honor i am the one who had on a two-bedroom or I am the one who built the entire house or apartment and viewers and subscribers most times nothing don't go like that right as the defendant I'm warning you that you must have all the documents that I have listed at hand so that if you are sued by anyone in your family your lawyer can defend the case against you in the court of law viewers and subscribers arlene souls youtube channel on instagram follow arlene souls on facebook and follow arlene souls on tiktok viewers and subscribers it's my pleasure sharing with you how it is that you can win yes all the secrets in how you can win a court case. It's Arlene Souls. See you in the next one.